Hey everybody, welcome to Yoga Shorts. My name is Lola and I am with the Forsyth County Public Library System in Georgia, inviting you to take a step away from your busy day, to take a moment for yourself, to take an intentional deep breath, and to move the body a little bit and to relax. And with me today I have my friend Jesse, who is taking an afternoon nap. So we may see her moving about a little bit. So today's positions are going to be um, actually kneeling positions on the floor, at least one or two knees down on the floor. So you might want to grab a blanket or a beach towel that can be folded up multiple times, or you could use a pillow um, from the sofa or from the bed. If your knees are sensitive, you'll want to um, be sure to make that comfortable and always take care of yourself. If it hurts, don't do it and follow any exercise guidance given to you by a doctor. First, let's get settled. So find yourself a comfortable seated position. I'm actually sitting on the edge of my blanket. You like fold it up multiple times. Finding myself in a comfortable position. You don't have to sit in this position, whatever feels good for you, as long as you're nice and stable and sturdy on the floor. And you can let your hands rest on your knees or you can let your hands rest in your lap, whatever feels more relaxing to you. So go ahead and close your eyes or lower your gaze. And first, let's just appreciate that we have a moment to ourselves. You get a moment to take a breath and see how you're feeling today. Start with a nice deep breath in. Maybe you notice when you take your inhale, you sit a little taller. And exhale, letting, that, letting it go, letting any tension go. Couple deep inhales and exhales. And check your posture as if you're seated taller, comfortable but tall position. You do actually allow more space for your lungs if you're sitting up tall. More breath moving in and out of the body. On the next inhale, take your shoulders up towards your ears. And then on the exhale, gently relax those shoulders down. Let's do that again. Inhale the shoulders up towards the ears. Exhale, relax the shoulders down. One more time. Inhale the shoulders up towards the ears. This time, exhale, relax those shoulders completely down. Check in with your jaw, make sure you're not holding any tension there as you continue your ni nice deep inhales and exhales. Scan the face. Actually take your fingers and just brush that spot in between your eyebrows where a lot of people hold tension. And let that go, continuing to let your breath flow, nice and deep inhales, nice slow exhales. And then on your next exhale, let your breath return to its natural rhythm. And then let your eyes come back open. See how you're feeling after taking some time to take some deep breaths. And then we'll go ahead and move on to our blanket pose. So the blanket is actually, or, or whatever you're using, pillow or towel, it's actually gonna be under the back knee. So make any adjustments to pull it back on your mat or on the carpet or floor, wherever you're sitting. So let's put the right knee down on our mat or on our folded blanket, and then we'll let the left knee come up front. So I've got my shin um, stacked right underneath my knee. So I'm gonna let my body be upright and my hands can rest on that front leg. So imagine that you're nice and tall, just like we were when we were seated. And you can either tuck that back toe or let the back foot rest on the top of the foot. If you feel like your balance is an issue, you might move um, that left leg out a little bit just to give a little bit wider uh, base for your balance. 
let your hands rest on that front leg. And as you're sitting or, um, upright, nice and tall, imagine that the tailbone is reaching down a little bit, the um, top of the head is reaching up a little bit, and you may begin to feel an opening in the front of that right leg. Take a breath here. And the next time you come to an inhale, send that right arm up. And exhale, the right arm comes back down. Let's do that two more times. Inhale, the right arm comes up. Exhale, the right arm floats down. Inhale, the right arm comes up. This time, exhale, leaving the arm up. And see if you can send your gaze upward. It doesn't have to be right to the hand, just a little bit upwards as you inhale and exhale. And when you come to an exhale again, let that right hand float back down. Put both hands on the ground and send that left leg back and then bring that right leg forward. So we're going to have the right knee bent this time. The left leg is down. Again, make sure that the knee is stacked over the shin, over the ankle. And widen that stance if you feel like you need to for balance, you can tuck that back toe or you can leave it flat on the floor, whichever feels better to you. So first, just sit tall or stand tall with your kneeling upright position. See if you begin to feel any opening in the front of that left hip. Take a breath here. And then on your next inhale, send that left arm up, inhaling. And exhale, the arm floats back down. Going to inhale that arm up and exhale, it floats back down. So inhale that left arm up, pause here, take a couple breaths. And if it's comfortable for you to look more upwards, you can look towards the hand or you can look straight ahead. Inhaling and exhaling here. Have a seat, check in with your shoulders, make sure they haven't crept up. And then when you come back around to an exhale, lower that hand down, both hands, and send the front leg back, and come find yourself back in your seated position. Make any adjustments to make your seated position comfortable. So this time we're gonna inhale and exhale just in our neutral position. So inhale the arms up overhead, Exhale, float the arms back down. Inhale the arms up overhead. Gaze towards them if you'd like, or keep the gaze straight ahead. Exhale down. And one more time, inhaling the arms up overhead. And exhale the arms down. So today we've practiced a low lunge position using a blanket or a pillow underneath the kneeling um, knee so that it keep it comfortable. And then taking the arm of the knee that is up supporting you, um, actually just the opposite, taking the arm of the leg that is back up overhead to see if we can find any opening in the front body on that side. So this is something that you can give a try. Um, if you find that that position for you, you've got a little more room, you can send that back leg back just a little bit further and into a little bit more of a lunge, but go carefully and listen to your body always, um, honor what you're feeling. So I hope this finds you doing well. Thanks for joining me and I hope to see you next time.